Hey, what's going on, guys? My name is Asian Psycho, and today I'm bringing you guys the final class setup for the AN94 assault rifle. Now, as as always, the perks are will remain the same, and the AN94 is actually a pretty surprising assault rifle when it comes to my attachment choices for it. And um, yeah, quick straw handle and adjustable stock are still there as usual, but because the iron sights are really good in my opinion, I think they're the best among the uh, among any of the assault rifle iron sights. Now that I think about it. Uh, let's see if if we've toggled through the uh, actually the Scar H, the M27, and the um, SWAT 5.56 five, iron sights are surprisingly good as well. But the M27, oh, didn't mean to do that. But the M27, Scar H, and the A94 are my three favorite assault rifles for iron sights. And the A94 and iron sights are very very clean. I do like them a lot. And with that being said. It kind of reduce, reduces the need for a sight. So, putting on reflex sight it was my favorite optical attachment. That and the EOTech on the AN94. But you know, if you don't really need it, or I felt that you, I didn't really need it because the iron sights were so good anyway. So what I instead did chose in the end was extended mags. And why that is, is because I found that while I was using the AN94, I was running out of bullets constantly. Like I would always shoot people, but I don't know. I don't know why, but it just seemed like my most sometimes uh, mo a lot of time my uh, my bullets just weren't connecting with the enemy, and I would have to use up what half a magazine up to like a full magazine or just take down just one person because I'm spraying so much. So extended mags actually really helped me out a lot, and I saw that on average my my amount of kills per magazine really really increased. Like I normally I would only kill like maybe one, two, three people at best with one magazine, and now even though I can only kill at most like three people with one magazine with extended mag. It still it, it happened more often. I mean, even, even though it was a slight change, it still happened more often. So the extended mags is, for me personally, a really good choice for the AN94. And uh, <clears throat> the whole thing about extended mags increasing your reload speed, it is true. But with the AN94, you can barely feel it. So uh, having extended mags there won't really reduce your reload speed time at all, if any. So um, that is a good thing. Another really good attachment that I that uh, is uh, that I found surprising was a select fire. Now, if you don't know about the select fire on the AN94, the select fire attachment on the AN94 changes changes the gun so that it fires in two round bursts. Unlike other weapons where they fire in three round bursts, the AN94 in real life and two it was developed to uh, fire in bursts of two bur uh, two bullets instead of three, the conventional three. So in game, it reflects that by uh, making the attachment select fire fire the AN94. Uh, you know shoot two bullets at a time and those two bullets fire at what elevated rate of fire of like 900 rp uh rate rounds per minute rpm so i found that that was actually pretty surprised it was pretty surprising uh or it was a surprisingly good attachment for the a94 because um it shoots those bullets really quickly and the burst delay between the burst bursts isn't that great at all so you can quickly you know pop two uh, two bursts down range and Boom! Your enemy's done. And with the AN94, the on select fire, the recoil is really, really low. So you can take down people really, really fast with the select fire on two, bur two round bursts. So with the select fire is a surprisingly good attachment. And with that, if you put on uh, an AN94 on the uh, if you put the AN94 on the two round burst uh, select fire option, then you'll find that you don't really need extended mags because hey, you'll be conserving your ammo because you'll be, you'll only be firing in bursts of two, and it's going to take you a lot longer to expend a bullet uh, a clip of 30 rounds on two, on a burst fire than, you know, full auto, which makes sense. So, yeah, either extended mags or select fire are my two optimal choices other than quick draw and stock, and uh, if you don't really prefer any either of those, then go with a sight of some kind, or if you want to be a douchebag and go around and noob duping people. But that, I found that the suppressor didn't really work well at the AN94. I guess it took away too much of its damage up at range, so I don't really like the suppressor on the AN94, but if that floats your boat, then hey, there you go. Uh, neither the laser sight. Meh. Laser sight is overall kind of icky on assault rifles in general, but the N94 especially, which is like uh, not even really worth it. So yeah, there you go. Those are my attachment choices for the N94. So that's my final class up. Thank you guys very much for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Good shit today.